Please welcome Executive Director Saab, Alex Amuyel. Hello, everyone. Just after I accepted the position at Solve, but before I started officially, I went off on a rainy day to meet an MIT professor in his office, and that was Admir Masic. We had an incredible conversation, and I was so happy about two things. First, that somebody with such incredible story and extraordinary skills was a professor at my new institution, MIT. And secondly, that he was going to be the challenge leader for the Solve Refugee Education Challenge. That we had someone who had been a refugee himself to lead this important work. I think that the solvers selected for this challenge, one of whom you just heard, and the people we brought together over the last two days to support them have exceeded Anmir and my expectation. The hard work, of course, is only beginning, and now we need to turn great connections into real partnerships that will have real impact on the ground. I'm also delighted to announce that the impact of the work will not stop here. As a follow-on to the Solve Refugee Education Challenge, and a great compliment, I'm delighted that MIT is doubling down on the solving the refugee education challenge. For that, I'd like to call Professor Admir Masich and Ian Waits, Dean of Engineering and soon Vice Chancellor to stage, and they'll tell you a little bit more about this. Let's start. Oh, yes. And let's start with a few words from Ian. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, Sometimes uh, very small actions can lead to very large positive uh, benefits. Um, I, many months ago, had read an article about a remarkable young faculty member at MIT who, as Alex has said, has a remarkable um, story. And a few days later, I was meeting with Jason Ponton, and I said, wait, I have an idea for you and a, and a person who can help lead it. And I think it, that led to catalyzing a marvelous community um, in refugee education in SOLVE, which, as Alex said, will persist. Um, and it's also led to um, catalyzing things uh, within MIT, and it's just a great pleasure for me to sort of be up here uh, with Admir uh, while he shares this uh, very good news with you. Admir. Thank you, Ian. Um, thank you for your support. And I must say, um, my story is uh, a little bit... Uh, uh, Nothing in comparison to what we just heard from Mariella. I must say, I was very lucky, <laughs> indeed. Uh, unlike many other refugees, I found an opportunity that uh, uh, ended up changing my life. And what really changed my life is the uh, opportunity to uh, get an education. Uh, this uh, um, Today, I'm standing here uh, with you, uh, as uh, at the best, uh, one of the best universities in the uh, in the world, uh, as a faculty and uh, and uh, uh, professor, uh, a dream that I had uh, when I arrived uh, when <laughs> in in Bosnia. Let's put it in this way. Uh, in, and then I realized uh, that in the technological revolution we are living now, these types of opportunities should not be a matter of luck. Uh, we ha be, have to be there and uh, give opportunity to every single uh, refugee and displaced people, uh, person in the world uh, to have the same chance uh, to succeed. With this in mind, uh, uh, I wanted to use uh, this forum to uh, announce an uh, exciting new uh, effort at MIT. MIT React, a Refugee Action Hub. Uh, is effort uh, to develop solutions uh, to address the crisis of uh, refugee education. Uh, MIT React will focus on three main objectives. Uh, we want to engage MIT community. Uh, we want to develop a, a certification uh, system based on, uh, for example, micromasters that are specifically uh, designed uh, and tailored for uh, displaced learners. Uh, we. 
the third, uh, third point, we would like to broader and outreach uh, uh, these efforts. And, uh, and we want to uh, put people around the world uh, in the position to, to find a job. Uh, and uh, uh, this could be the key of their uh, success in these uh, very challenging uh, conditions. So this effort uh, has been made possible by support uh, from uh, friends of Sol, uh, including Hala Fadel, uh, the founder and chair of uh, uh, MIT Enterprise Forum uh, of the Pan-Arab region, uh, and uh, Saeed Darwazzah, chairman and uh, uh, executive director of Hikma. Uh, I, need that, I need to say that I'm very emotionally <laughs> uh, uh, touched by uh, all this uh, effort that uh, uh, we are putting in, uh, in refugees. And uh, I would like to thank I Ian for your, uh, for your uh, support. I would like to thank uh, Solve and uh, all solvers that uh, contributed uh, and helped me to go through this learning process. And I would like to invite all of you to uh, to join me in this uh, uh, React Hub and uh, look for uh, new opportunities for refugees around the world. Thank you.